Hey folks, I have another glorious app pick for you today. This is HTML House, available from html.house. This is a really great little web app that effectively is paste bin, but for HTML code. You put in the HTML code, and based on that code, HTML House gives you a web page. It's very straightforward, and I can think of countless uses for it. Uh, this is the interface itself, very straightforward, um, and effectively it uh, it updates the uh, the visuals in real time. So if I wanted to just do a quick, um, you know, quick update there, that's how it works, and you can change all of this stuff. I think that's about right. Yeah, uh, and let's just change it for the sake of it to a nice serif font there we go something something a little bit more uh classic i guess it gives you a little bit of a uh, a pre-done setup uh for example this line here uh this actually just makes it more readable for example on, on mobile devices it tells you to adjust the page to uh to mobile screens but you can put basically any code in here and it will present it as it should do so what i'm going to do just as a demonstration of how neat this uh, this little tool is, is that I've brought up my NeoCities website. In fact, this isn't the NeoCities website. This is my NeoCities website. But I never miss an opportunity to promote my NeoCities website because it is, well, I'm actually quite proud of it. It just lists a load of open source applications and a few closed source ones that I think are particularly useful. So feel free to check that out. Links are usually in the description for that. However, for today's purposes, I'd just like to use the code. So this is the NeoCities code editor. It's not a bad code editor. Uh, tabs equal two spaces, in case you were wondering. Uh, but I'm going to select all the code. I'm going to control C it. And then I'm going to pop it in here. And there you go, immediately updated. Now, of course, you may notice the styles didn't carry through. And that is because I have a uh, separate style sheet. So if I just put in my website URL there, which I can't even spell my own name. So that'll go down well on the internet, I'm sure. Okay, so and there we go. That's effectively the uh, the website there and then presented as it is. And then uh, we just do a quick publish. And then what it does is it gives you a very sort of paste bin style URL, as you can see at the top here, and then presents your website as thus. You've got a few little controls in the top uh, right hand corner here, but they don't really add too much to the end code. This is the code. The uh, controls that you see is just this little div tag over here. So there we go. That is HTML house. It is in fact um, open source, kind of. Uh, I didn't manage to find a specific license for it, but the code is available on GitHub and they do have guidelines for contributing. So there is that. But um, I don't think I managed to find anything specific in terms of whether or not it's like an Apache license or GPL. I think that it's it seems to be a little bit more um, uh, sort of a bit more custom in that regard. But, uh, but you know, the code is readily available, which uh, ticks the box for me. So uh, yeah, check it out, html.house. Um, neat little tool and uh, I'm sure we'll find some pretty uh, pretty neat uses for it. So that's about it for me today. Thank you very much for watching. And until next time, I've been Chris Ware, and you've been awesome. Take care now.